forging new connections. Oh, this is a new one. Oh, it's, so bad. it's been four years since this high school embraced a fresh identity, rebadging itself as Dianella Secondary College. We were Mirabuka Senior High School on Nolamara Avenue in Dianella. So it was a little bit confusing for our, um, our community. So that was part of the reason. But also a chance to, yes, rebrand, but to have some renewal. The primary school next door, an education support centre, took on the new name too. College is very unusual for a primary school, I completely agree with that. Um, but it was an opportunity for us to align ourselves with the secondary school and the education support centre. Rebranding comes with costs, signage, websites and stationery. Brand new uniforms phased in. The community says it's been worth it. Now everyone's like, oh, like, I know, like, they talk about it and it's, we feel more included, I guess. I feel like students love it, especially with the new uniforms. Oh, absolutely worth it. Um, again, it, we talk about perception for whatever that looks like and our um, opinion survey from last year overwhelmingly said that our community are, are proud of, of Dianella Secondary College. Like here at Dianella, many schools have elected over the years to change their names to include the word college. And for most new public high schools, it's their choice from day one. Marketing experts say the word college is a simple way for some state schools to change community perception, particularly as the words often linked to the private school sector. So by just using a different term, it sounds quite simplistic, but it actually suggests that it all of a sudden becomes a bigger environment or a bigger experience. Despite the change, students say the school is more than a name. <laughs> I've talked to my friends and they, I don't think the name really affected them that much because the school is still the same. The teachers, the staff, they're still lovely. A school is a school and a name shouldn't define it. 65 public schools in WA now have the college descriptor in their name, with another in Piara Waters potentially on track to join them in a couple of years. Jessica Warriner, ABC News.